Hey guys, Marlo back with another unboxing and review. And if you saw my previous videos on my latest Masters of the Universe pickups, you would have seen that I also picked up the Sunman set. This was exclusive to Target. It's a three-pack set, which includes Pighead, Sunman, and Space Sumo. And uh, I know they released Pighead separately, and of course Sunman was the first, but this one has an alternate head sculpt, which is quite different and I like this head sculpt a lot better. The uh, previous ones looked like he was a lot younger, like a kid in my opinion. So this one he looks a little bit more like a more mature uh, Sun Man. And as far as Space Sumo there, not too familiar with this guy, but we'll take a closer look at all of them once we get them out of package there. You can see some nice artwork at the top. 40th anniversary for Masters of the Universe and He-Man. The back of the package there if you want to read that just pause the video as I'll just keep moving along again some great artwork and again just pause the video if you need to to read stuff some images there instructions and whatnot so that is the box set uh, again at Target if you need there is the barcode hopefully you can pause the video and scan that at your local target if you need to as of uh, the recording of this video what is it now October 5th 2022 uh, yeah you can pick this up for about $50 retail at Target so let's go ahead and open it up and take a closer look at all of these figures out of package and here we have each of the figures out of their packages and they come with these nice little I don't know, they're kind of cardboard prints. Uh, I thought they would be like mini comics. They kind of look like mini comics, but uh, again, they're just more or less little cards. Uh, some nice artwork, again, of each character. We have Pigman here, and at the back of the card, a little uh, bio or summary of the character. So just, you know, again, pause the video if I'm moving too quickly here. For Sun Man, again, some great artwork. His little write up there at the back. And last but not least, we have Sumo. And his write up at the back there. So, kind of cool. Let me see. Let me flip them all over. Some kind of crazy, I don't know, it looks like almost Egyptian type motif going on there at the back. So yeah, just makes for some nice display pieces or cards to display with your figures. Alright, so off the bat we have Pigman. I don't have the regular version. Don't plan to pick it up since I have this version now, just to save some money. Uh, for you diehard collectors, I guess you would want to pick, pick up that version probably. Um, as far as I know, the paint job on this version is a little bit different. The colors are pretty much the same but this has a more pearlescent uh, sheen to it like with the purple portions there it kind of looks a bit pearlescent don't know if it's coming across on camera but that's what I uh, you know believe I've seen in other photos and videos uh, I think some of the skin tone might be a little bit lighter on the regular version as well but anyways, yeah, he's, he's more or less going to be the same. I believe he comes with the same weapons. Again, just a bit more of a sheen and pearlescent kind of uh, color paint job to this version. Sun Man, this is what, the third version? The first version, if you got the exclusive, had the vac metalized parts, like on the chest plate there, shield and sword, I believe. Uh, the regular release was the same thing, just without the vac metalized parts. And I think, yeah, that only came with one head portrait, whereas the exclusive came with two. And now we have this one, pretty much the same body as the regular release, but with a new portrait here. Again, a more, in my opinion, a more adult looking uh, version of Sun Man with a flat top hairdo, which I think is kind of cool. Uh, same sword and shield, and... This is the first release for Space Sumo. I'm guessing he'll eventually come out on his own individual card. Don't know if he's going to look any different or have some different paint job going on or accessories, but this is 
how he comes in the three pack. His uh, little ninja mask is removable. It's kind of rubberized. Oops, there you go. And there is his portrait. He also has a flat top of all things. Hmm, hold on a second. I think they're the same head sculpt. Yeah, I think they are. So yeah, they're using the same sculpt there for Sun Man and Sumo. Just, of course, one is uh, colorized with darker skin tone and the other one lighter. So wow, that's kind of surprising. But anyways, he's going to have the mask on for the most part. And it's kind of, yeah, it's not too obvious. So that's kind of kind of trippy there. So yeah, let me get these guys posed up for you guys. And here we have all three with their accessories looking pretty cool in my opinion. And I'm not really going to go over articulation. You guys who are collecting these Origins figures, you know that they're pretty much just using all the same body parts and uh, whatnot, just recoloring everything and adding, you know, different accessories and head sculpts and gear. So they're all going to be the same interchangeable parts as I can imagine. So I'll just give you a closer look at details. Love the paintwork on this version of Pighead. And kind of a goofy character, but also nightmarish at the same time. Come on, guys. Look at that crazy tusk coming out of his mouth there. Man, if this guy was out there in real life, he'd be pretty nightmarish. Even more scary than Skeletor, I would imagine. Here is Sun Man. Again, I'm digging this newer head sculpt and portrait. Like it a lot better. But it's kind of tripping me out now that I know that Space Sumo is using the same head sculpt. So I'm pretty much going to keep Space Sumo under his mask. So there he is. Looking pretty cool with his sword. And, uh, you know, I guess it's a win-win for all you Masters of the Universe fans and action figure collectors as far as, you know, getting more characters in the Motu universe as well as showing some diversity, representing, you know, different ethnic characters. That's pretty cool in my opinion, so can't beat that. Loving the line so far, looking forward to seeing more from the Sun Man collection. Anyways, Hopefully you guys enjoyed this unboxing and review. Again, it is a Target exclusive. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to share the video, like the video. And if you haven't already, please do subscribe to my channel. As always, take care, stay safe, keep on collecting, and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.